Hey everyone, it's time for another movie review and today's film we'll be talking about is a film that I cannot stand. I absolutely hated this film. I had to see this film again like just last night just so I could review this today. Um, this is going to be more of a rant because I cannot stand this um, film whatsoever. Um, if you saw my review of The Borderlands, I was comparing this to another film which had two similar cover arts. I I absolutely hated this film, but there is a film that is much, much, much worse, and that film is Back From Hell. Back From Hell. It can go back to hell. This film... <sighs> This film, there, there's nothing good about this film. I absolutely hate it. It's possibly the worst piece of the crap I've ever had to sit through. It's one of those found footage films where these paranormal investigators, they go up to this location, and this film is a church. Um, they do fuck all. They do fuck all in this film. Basically all they do is wander around the church in the dark, with video cameras screaming going, ah, 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 and that's all the films. Apparently they've been taken over by the devil or demons or something like that. No, you just run around the church in the dark screaming like a retard. No. The first time I got this this film only cost me like seven quid. Um when I first saw this film, I couldn't even get through the first five minutes of it. It's like this annoying cunt going, Oh, let's make a boogography, let's make a boogography, and he's touching his girl's tits and that. Now, I do normally enjoy a pair of tits, but the way this guy's acting in it, it's like, what the fuck? It's just so cringy, I thought, fuck this, I'm turning it off. This, the guy's actor is called Robert Z. Betty. Now, I recognise him from a film called Sleepless, which is actually a good film. But in this film, he is an absolute annoying cunt, and I just wanted to punch him in the face. He is, oh, uh, his character is, oh, I couldn't do it. So, a few months later, I came back to this film, and uh, I, couldn't, I couldn't do it again. I got to the hour mark, and I thought, fuck this, I'm turning it off. But because I've reviewed Borderlands, I thought I'd review this film as well. So last night, I watched it again. I was so depressed after watching it because it's crap. It is absolutely crap. All they do, like I say, they just wander around the church. That's it. Apparently this is scary. I'm going to say this now. To make a good found fishes film, don't wander around the dark screaming. Actually film something happening because this is boring. I can honestly say there's nothing I can recommend about this film. Maybe the location is a church is quite spooky. But no. No, nothing happened. This is bullshit. If you like this film, then you're an idiot. Just go jump off a cliff. I'm joking, but this 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 film uh, no. uh, it makes me so angry just thinking about this film. It just Oh uh, it's just people wandering around with a video camera in the dark. And apparently, this is a film. They do like this Ouija board thing. And clearly, there's like you can see the fingers moving around, like those panel, um, those paranormal kind of reality shows. Absolute bullshit. As a found footage film, it is shit. As a film, as a normal film, it is shit. Everything about this film is shit. Give this a rating. I don't want to give this a rating, but I'm gonna give it a zero. A zero. There's. Don't go and see this film because it's just wasting your time. Um, I know I ripped on Borderlands, but you may still enjoy that. But this, I cannot, I cannot imagine you join this film. It is bullshit. Absolutely bullshit. Well, I'm gonna send this film back to hell. Yep, that's been my review of 
back from hell. Um, <sighs> anyway, um, thanks for watching my review. Um, hope you can post some more soon. But anyway, thanks for watching and goodbye.